Other countries' pollution levels. For example, like we have us as a country where we have decent regulations regarding the environment, but other developing countries such as China, India, they have a zero to none, no regulations. I think the education at ESF is a great thing because it presents a broad view of possibilities and ideas. So it allows an incoming freshman like me the ability to interpret what's going on and to best apply into my career field later on in life. I think we have too much waste as a nation. We um, produce more than the earth can hold. We can go into a, a national aspect of like law and um, working for like the EPA type thing and um, lobby it to make it mandatory of how to get rid of it and better solutions. As a whole, I think that the world is going to run out of resources before we come up with a new, uh, new energy source. I think that we need to find another reliable energy source, a renewable energy source, and stop relying on the fossil fuels that we use today. I would like to research and try to help this problem. Uh, rising sea levels. Why is that? Because it's going to affect where people live, and it's probably going to wipe out all of, like the towns on the coastal lines, and then the then obviously the North Pole is melting. Hydrofracking, I'm, I'm not a huge fan of it. I think most of the time they, the companies that are involved with it, they mess it up and then poison the water supplies around the neighborhoods. And uh, there was one documentary they saw, they turned on their hose and then they lit their water on fire because it was leaking into their water supply and all the natural gas. I think there's, there should be a come up with a better way of harvesting that natural resource.